We're going to be setting up the Vista AVS unit, walking through the menu options. Beginning with the front of the unit, we have our on-off switch, the feed button for the paper, the door release for the paper, and your volume control. Pressing the enter menu key will open your options menu. Pressing the number one button on the hand control will open your configure examination. This lists the different exams that you can choose to perform. Pressing the enter menu key on your hand control twice to take you back to options menu. Pressing number two for system settings. Number one would set your clock. Pressing number one to set the clock will bring up the month, day, year, hour, and minutes to be entered. Pressing the enter menu. Pressing number two, contrast adjustment level. Noticing that the number as I continue to press the number two, the level number will change as the brightness of the screen changes to your desired contrast. Pressing number three, automatic power down off. Pressing number three again to choose on. This is going to tell the unit if you want it to automatically power down after no use for 20 minutes, you would have that on. Or pressing number three to turn that off, the system would need to be manually turned off. Pressing number four, file annotation by name. Pressing number four again changes that option to number. So you can either have your patient information entered by name or number. Option number five, dual ankle pressure high. Pressing number five changes that to low or off. Some of the ABI exams that would need to be turned off. In general, you will have that on high so that you have the PT and DP option on your menu. Pressing number six, ABI segmental pressure Doppler. Pressing number six changes that to PPG. This is telling the unit which modality you'll be using to perform your exam. On the hand control, pressing number three for file management. This is where you would choose to save your current exam to the file, delete your exam from the file, recall an exam, download exam from file, or download the current exam. Pressing enter menu key twice to go back to options menu. Next we have number four, individual site mode. You would choose this option when you are not doing a full ABI exam. You would like to just get a pressure at one specific site. Using your up and down arrows, you would choose your modality and then pressing your site key to choose which body part. Going down to exit, pressing the enter menu key to exit and again for the option menu. Pressing number five, new exam, keep brachials. That would be used when you have performed an exam. You want to redo your pressures at the ankles, but you want to keep your brachial pressures. Pressing the enter menu again to go back to options menu. Number six, new exam, clear all. I want to start a brand new exam and clear all of my previous data. And number seven, view seated ABI hydrostatic correction. When we are going to do a seated ABI, needing to add in that hydrostatic correction. And that completes the overview of the menu options on the Vista AVS system.